Laurent Kossiomni Childhood Story Plus Untold Biography Facts Early Life Laurent Kossiomni was born on the 10th day of September 1985 in Toul, the third largest town in the Limousin region of France and a wrong place to play soccer, with odds heavily stacked against its citizenry. Laurent Kosciolny was born to Mr. and Mrs. Bernard Kosciolny who together with their son hold Polish nationalities. Laurent grew up in a mining family in Toul, a commune in central France, a place where emptiness ends when there's a football at one's feet. His childhood story is interesting, if not uncommon that of a little boy with a rag-to-riches story who became blessed with extraordinary talent. Laurent during his childhood time possessed a steely determination to make his dreams come true. His ambitions were not just a passing fancy. Laurent's likeness for football came, thanks to his elder brother who tied but never made it in the game. In his words and the idea of playing as a professional footballer was only a mere dream. A sort of fantasy every child of my age could hope for. At that time, the only thing I was thinking about was to play soccer, play and play again. Enjoying myself, being with my friends and sharing quality time with them. Playing soccer was all I was concerned about, like most children of my age would be. Laurent Kossiomni Childhood Story Plus Untold Biography Facts Career In Summary Laurent began his career in 2004 with Gingham, a team that had produced such talents as Didier Drogba and Florent Malauda. He started his professional career as a right-hand back and it took only three years before he became a force to reckon. Laurent applied a lot of work, sacrifices, and rigor which led him to be promoted to Gingamp senior squad where he switched to fullback. As soon as Laurent was 18 years old, he started saving money to provide for myself and my family. He later moved up the French league ranks as he played for Tours and Lorient, helping the later get a promotion to French top flight football. It was Laurent's aggressive defensive style that attracted Arsenal who confirmed his signing on July 7, 2010. The Arsenal board sealed the deal but Arsene Wenger couldn't give final approval because was in South Africa and left his mobile phone at home. That was a time Kossioni caused a stir as French newspapers reported that he went on to train with his Arsenal teammates without his transfer announcement and deal finalised by Wenger. He later finalised and was handed the club's number 6 shirt, previously worn by Philippe Senderos, who had moved to Fulham. The rest, as they say, is now history. Laurent Kossiomni Childhood Story Plus Untold Biography Facts Relationship Life There is a saying that every nice piece of work needs the right person in the right place and at the right time. Surely, Laurent Kossiomni's on-pitch person has an off-pitch life which has been complemented by a beautiful and long-time girlfriend Claire Butuin. Both lovers got married in the year 2015 with a number of Arsenal and French teammates being in attendance. Although the French press seemed more interested in Raphael Vrain's wedding which happened on the same day. Kossiolny did not allow French press to take pictures of his wedding ceremony. We can only presume that the Kossiolny's planned to sell their pictures as one of the few to be posted online came from Bakri Sagna's wife Lou Divine. Laurent and Claire have two lovely kids and the names, Mena and Noah Kossiolny pictured below with their dad. 
My children helped me move forward in life. Says, La Ron. After his training sessions, Laron loves to go pick up his kids at school and look after them until the end of the afternoon when his wife returns from work. Laron calls the only childhood story plus untold biography facts family facts. Starting off with his family, Kosciolny's grandfather was Polish. He emigrated to northern France to work as a Polish miner. Unfortunately, over time both him and other members of his family lost the Polish language and roots. Laurent's father played in the fourth division of French football for many clubs before becoming a manager. Kosciolny has credited his father, Bernard for keeping him down to earth and helping him always remember where he came from and how he should stay true to his roots. His father was a big asset to him someone who understood very well the world of soccer. As Kosciolny puts it, and he knew what could happen if I did not keep my feet grounded. Fortunately. He always kept an eye on me and remained always present to advise me on the choices I wanted to make. I think I have been very lucky. I received a very good education, both from my parents and my siblings. They all taught me essential values. And today, it is my turn to transmit those to my children. Laurent Kosciolny's mother has always been behind him to provide motherly support. And still today, she is very present in his life. As he puts it, she is and has always been an essential figure in my career and life. A guardian angel. He has a footballing brother who is 10 years older than him and once played in the amateur leagues. Laurent Kosciolny Childhood Story Plus Untold Biography Facts Personal Life Laurent Kosciolny has the following attribute to his personality. Laurent Strengths, he is loyal. Both club and wife, reserved, analytical, hardworking, and very practical. Laurent's weaknesses, shyness, could get worried over stuff, overly critical of self and others, and is an all work and no play person. What Laurent likes, he likes animals, healthy food, books, nature, and general cleanliness. What Laurent dislikes, Rudeness, asking for help and taking center stage. Laurent is someone who always paying attention to the smallest details and his deep sense of humanity makes him one of the most careful person you'll ever know. His methodical approach to life ensures that nothing is left to chance. Laurent is someone who could be often misunderstood. Not because he lacks the ability to express, but because he won't accept his feelings as valid, true, or even relevant when opposed to reason. Laurent Kosciolny Childhood Story Plus Untold Biography Facts Friendship The beginning of his Arsenal career was not so smooth. However, it didn't take long before our scene winger fell in love with his physical prowess and since then, Laron has accustomed himself to the legendary manager. Laron calls the only childhood story plus untold biography facts cue in a session. 
Laurent has answered some QA questions worth knowing about. Who is the toughest player you have had to face in a game? Drogba, without hesitation. Where, which game did you experience your biggest setback? The final of the Euro in France. It was a difficult time for us. Because it was an event that everyone expected in France. I think that overall it was a success, but ending with a defeat was very painful. There is always a bitter feeling of finishing an adventure like this in that way. When you're about to go out on the field, what do you think about? When I go out on the field, I do not think much about it. Once we're done with hand tying ceremonies, I try to concentrate on my game and only on my game, to remind myself of the things I have to do during the match, I try to give the best of my team, to have the best result.